Numerous financial aid options are available to Southern Union students, including grants, loans, work-study programs, and scholarships. Funds are available from federal, state, institutional, and independent sources. Federal funds are usually the starting point for financial aid packages. Programs include federal Pell Grants, Supplemental Education Opportunity Grants, and the Federal College Work Study Program. Pell Grants are awards that do not require repayment. Grants range from $400 to $4,050 a year and are based on individual or family financial circumstances. Applicants must first complete the free application for Federal Student Aid, or FAFSA. This is available at Southern Union's Financial Aid Office or online at www.fafsa.ed.gov. Federal Supplemental Educational Opportunity Grants are awarded to Pell Grant recipients who show exceptional need. As with Pell Grants, applicants must submit a FAFSA form. Funds are limited so students are encouraged to apply early. The Federal College Work Study Program allows students to work on campus for 10 to 15 hours per week. Students are urged to apply early for this program. In-state residents can apply for Alabama Student Assistance Program grants. Priority is given to Pell Grant recipients and the FAFSA must be submitted. Additional financial aid programs are listed on screen. Our financial aid office can provide more information and assistance. Southern Union offers academic, athletic, technical, and performing arts scholarships. Institutional and independent scholarships are also available for specific fields of study such as nursing. To find out more, visit Southern Union's financial aid office. Southern Union is committed to providing you with a quality education. We also care about your quality of life on campus. Let's look at some aspects of student life, along with a few rules designed to make college life healthy and safe. Students can enjoy the comfort and convenience of on-campus housing at our Wadley location. Applications are available from our Student Services Office. Books and other student supplies can be purchased at any Southern Union campus. Food services are located on our Wadley and Opelika campuses. Athletic events on our Wadley campus include men's and women's basketball, men's baseball, women's softball, volleyball, cheerleading, and cross country. Southern Union's student clubs and organizations cover a wide range of civic, professional, and recreational interests. More information is available in your college catalog and on our Southern Union website. To ensure your health and safety, Southern Union maintains and enforces drug-free, alcohol-free campuses and workplaces. As an additional safety measure, students may park only in designated areas and must have their parking tags on display at all times while on campus. Regulations are strictly enforced and violations can result in fines or the towing of vehicles. Our college judiciary system deals with campus disciplinary cases. Consult your catalog for more information about the system and process. Fines for tuition and fee payments are set for each semester. Specific dates can be found in your college catalog and class schedule. The drop ad period takes place for the first week of the fall and spring term and the first two days of the summer term. If you drop classes and add none, a refund will be issued you'll receive a refund check around the middle of the semester. If you add classes, you must pay for them at the time they are added to your schedule. Classes cannot be added after the drop add period. Any classes dropped after this time will not be refunded. To withdraw from a class, you must complete and submit a withdrawal form. You will receive a refund only if this process is completed within the first three weeks of the semester. Refund amounts are based on the scale shown here. You'll receive a refund check during the middle of the semester. You can withdraw from a class up to the date published in the college catalog and class schedule. Approval is required when withdrawing after the specified date. The standard grading scale at Southern Union is shown here. 
As seen earlier in this telecourse, grading scales in the Health Sciences Division differ from those listed. The designation incomplete is recorded when assigned work is not completed during the semester. An incomplete is given only by an instructor's permission. If all work is not completed by the following semester, this automatically becomes an F. An audit grade is not recorded as a college credit. Students who choose to audit classes pay the same fees and do the same work, with the exception of exams. Quality points are the numerical average assigned to earned grades, as indicated here. These are used to help determine your grade point average, or GPA. Let's use this example to show how GPAs are calculated. Earned quality points are determined by multiplying quality points by credit hours. For example, an A carries four quality points. Multiplied by the three credit hours earned in the class, you have 12 earned quality points. Repeat this calculation for each course taken in a given semester. Add your total credit hours and earned quality points for that semester and proceed to the next step. Take your total number of earned quality points and divide them by the total credit hours. This is your semester GPA. For cumulative GPAs, use the total points and hours from two or more semesters and repeat the process. Grade point averages are directly related to your standards of progress. You must maintain a certain GPA not only to graduate, but also to avoid academic probation, suspension, or loss of financial aid. Earning a degree or certificate gives you a leg up when it comes to your future. And maintaining a high grade point average has its perks as well. Students with a term GPA of 3.50 are recognized on Southern Union's Dean's List, and those with a 4.0 term GPA make the President's List. These lists are published each semester in local and regional newspapers and periodicals. Academic excellence is also recognized at graduation and indicated on your diploma. Students with a cumulative GPA between 3.50 and 3.69 graduate with honors. Cumulative GPAs from 3.70 to 3.89 earn high honors. Students who maintain a cumulative GPA of 3.90 to 4.0 graduate with highest honors. Students in technical programs with cumulative GPAs from 3.50 to 4.0 receive certificates with distinction. More information about these and other policies can be found in your college catalog. The Student Development Division provides valuable support services for Southern Union students. These services include recruiting, placement testing, academic advising, special needs counseling, diversity programs, and tutorial services. Southern Union recruiters take part in area high school programs and assist with annual academic and athletic tournaments. Recruiters also make presentations to civic and community groups. Assessment, placement, and specialized testing is coordinated through the Student Development Division. Services include compass testing, as well as GED, ACT, Health Sciences Admission, and other testing services. Academic advisors and designated faculty members are on hand at each campus to help students plan developmental, technical, and transfer programs. Stay in contact with your advisor. Let him or her know about any changes and always feel free to ask questions. Special needs counseling is available on all campuses to assist with educational, career, and personal challenges. Counselors can also direct students to resource material on careers and undergrad programs. Tutoring services are available free of charge to all Southern Union students. Information is posted in classrooms, on bulletin boards, and on our website. Open computer labs are available for using tutorial software. To learn more about student development services, consult your catalog or speak with your academic advisor. To complete the requirements for your orientation course, you must meet with your academic advisor. 
you'll find your advisor's name and location at the top right-hand corner of your orientation workbook. Keep this information handy for future reference while here at Southern Union. You must complete your workbook and turn it in to your academic advisor before mid-semester. At this time, you'll receive a copy of your program of study and or your contractual agreement. It's also a great time to ask questions and make sure that you and your advisor are on the same page. Use your Southern Union catalog and schedule booklet as valuable resources and don't hesitate to ask for help. That's why we're here. We hope this telecourse has been useful to you. And whether this is the beginning of your college education or a major step toward career advancement, we wish you every success. Thanks for choosing us and welcome to the Southern Union family.